वेलकम टू माय चैनल पी कॉन्सेप्ट्स सीएचएम दिस इज द सिक्स पार्ट ऑफ द सीरीज ऑफ थर्मोडायनेमिक्स वी विल सी द सेकंड एप्लीकेशन ऑफ फर्स्ट लॉ ऑफ थर्मोडायनेमिक्स द फर्स्ट एप्लीकेशन वी हैड सीन इन द लास्ट वीडियो so this is the second application that is the relation between pressure volume temperature in an adiabatic interaction for an ideal gas so now we will see the second application of first law of thermodynamics relation between pressure volume temperature in an adiabatic interaction for an ideal gas consider n moles of an ideal gas now for an adiabatic process dq will be zero in the first law of thermodynamics so du plus dw is equal to zero substituting dw here as pdv also in the last video we had derived du is equal to n into cv dt again from the last derivation that we had seen in the last video cp minus cv is equal to r so from there we have substituted cv as cp minus r this is equation 1 and this is equation 2 open up the brackets you get ncp dt minus nr dt plus pdv is equal to 0 equation 3 for an ideal gas we will write pv is equal to nrt differentiating we get pdv plus vdp is equal to nr dt rearrange the equation take vdp on the other side it will become minus vdp and nr dt is taken on this side equation 4 substituting equation 4 in equation 3 this is equation 3 here we can substitute here pdv minus nr dt from equation 4 so we get ncp dt minus vdp is equal to 0 so ncp dt is equal to vdp equation 5 now from equation 1 this is equation 1 we get ncv dt is equal to minus pdv equation 6 divide equation 5 by equation 6 we get cp by cv is equal to minus vdp upon pdv ratio of these specific heats is equal to gamma so equating both of this taking this minus vdp upon pdv on the other side you get gamma plus vdp upon pdv is equal to 0 we are just rearranging the terms we are taking dv here below v v upon dv into dp by p multiplying throughout by dv by v you get gamma into dv by v plus dp by p is equal to 0 integrating we get gamma ln v plus ln p is equal to ln k k is a constant using the rules of logarithm you can write down this as ln of p v raised to gamma is equal to ln k this can be written as p v raised to gamma is equal to k equation 7 now p v is equal to nrt rearrange the equation to get p that is nrt by v substituting this p in equation 7 you get nrt v raised to gamma upon v is equal to k 
nr is a constant we are taking on the other side here so k upon nr is a constant so that we will denote as k dash this v you can take up so that you will get as t into v raised to gamma minus 1 is equal to k dash equation 8 again you use the ideal gas equation pv is equal to nrt we get v is equal to nrt by p we can substitute this v in the equation 7 we get p into nrt upon p the whole raised to gamma is equal to k same way again take nr on the other side below k and this we can denote this is a constant we will denote it as k double dash so finally we get p raised to gamma into p raised to 1 minus gamma is equal to k double dash equation 9 so this way we get the relations between p and v v and t and here p and t for watching this video.